everybody, welcome to another house building video. Today I am doing a bonus video, which is um, the solid color community build. And I've been a bit late with it, as everyone already did it. And um, there was some delay in it, and after that I got it really, really busy. So it took me some longer. So that's why this is a bonus video for today. I announced this on my Twitter because um, for me it's 2 o'clock. And it's not really the time that I normally upload. But yeah, it really needed to air. And everything in the rest of the planning was kind of already shot and was already uploaded to youtube so i thought why not do a bonus video so this collab is together with josie jam unique simmer louise gravy roxy and me and they're all linked down below and of course simmer kelly i may not forget her simmer kelly so all these lovely simmers will be mentioned down below go check them out if you don't follow them don't are not subscribed to them oh, what are you waiting for come on so yeah um you see me getting around the build um somehow my computer had real struggles with loading this build um i think first of all because i didn't own all the packs that somehow my computer was a bit um i don't know being uh, a total um a biatch about it but yeah um after all it worked out and yeah I hope you guys like it and if you know me know me on Twitter or have ever talked to me black is like it's not the color but le let's just say it's the color but it's like uh, everything to me I wear black all day every day so I was really happy to do uh, black which again isn't a color but let's act all to it shall we so yeah I it went, went a bit difficult sometimes as um, I needed to work a lot with lining because sometimes it got a bit annoying. I don't know how much you will notice that in the video in a moment to furnishing it, but I put up a lot of lights here and there because it got annoying. But yeah, you will all see that very shortly. So I went with um, a kind of, it, it is a traditional styled home. As you can see, the layout is very symmetrical. Um, you won't call it gothic because it's not that eerie because the inside is pretty modern actually it's just um i went really really far with the black the only color that i added to it was green as in plants and maybe some accents on some toys because this is a four person house um, some did, I think, one of the builds is also a starter and we just have a bit of everything in here. But I really wanted to go with black all out and there's barely any color in it. We really, really, really went in with the black. <laughs> so yeah, the only color you will see are green from plants and accents. But um, when I scroll through the rest of the houses, which are awesome by the way, so go check out every single house. Um, some of them incorporate more shades as it is. Maybe a bit of, um, I don't know how to explain it. Here and there I saw what more transition shades or shades that really matched. But it was not always the exact same shade. Not that there's something wrong with it. Because I think those houses maybe have turned out better. Because they did that. But yeah. I wanted to go full on with the black. Which was difficult. I made it so difficult. Because it got so dark. But I love black. And actually I wouldn't mind living in this home. Because it's also. It gives you a mind of. I, it, at least me. It gives a lot of peace and quiet. Because it's so beautifully dark. And comforting and not so bright and jumpy on you really weird but here you see the room is kind of well the flooring more likely is kind of glitching out i don't know what was wrong with it but we fixed it in the end and here you see that it um yeah everything all the walls are black i think in the living room there's like one trim that's more brown like and in the master bedroom it's one bit brown uh yeah 
again i thought like these um not doors but like the cutouts I'm, i don't know what they're called but they are apparently dark brown but i looked really close and i felt like they're black so we just say we're black right so yeah um if you guys are ever open for collabs just like this one or one-on-one -on -one collabs Please hit me up because I'm so down for this because now I am doing this solid color community build. Um, I, next week on Wednesday I will be collabing with Monica Builds to make a lovely modern house. I do the outer shell, she does the inside. I'm really excited for that. Um, and I'm still working on the sassy safe but always if you want to collab hit me up. If you hit me up right now, it will most likely be a collab at the end of April. Because as I may have told, I'm going away for a little trip. And after that, I'm going to a LAN party. So um, recording is really hard <laughs> around that time. So this is also pre-recorded in some way. Like it's the last one of the last videos I recorded, but it's still a pre-recording to me because it's all scheduled out and yeah. I'm still down for collabing, but sorry guys, it will be a bit later. So yeah, um here I'm getting around um the downstairs. The downstairs, like the living room is pretty much done. It's not that cluttered. I liked it pretty clean. The rest of the um houses i wanted to say the rest of the houses the rest of the rooms are a bit more cluttered in a way like i've got one children's room which is part of twins and that is more childish like really a lot of stuff's going on there which i really like and one thing i really liked is this kitchen because i never did like this semi built-in kitchen like the nook in the walls was actually perfectly fit for the kitchen so it's a really tiny one but it's still very cool um because it's really worked in well and i genuinely would love a kitchen like this um yeah and i think that i just put in some decoration somewhat more lightning because i thought this place was really difficult especially this part to light up and here i decided like damn I will just put in red because I wanted like I wanted to do this first like I thought this would be cool but then I was like I need to do work with plants like try to keep everything of the furniture itself black but like the plants can be colored I guess I think that ain't cheating I guess because we practically don't have black plants like I would do a full Kat Von D. If you don't know Kat Von D, she's a makeup artist. But she has a black garden. And I would love to recreate it because I love black so much. But The Sims doesn't have black flowers. Probably. So, as it isn't there, I thought, okay, well, just go with green and different colors, but not go too fancy. And here you see that I decided to... Um, not put anything like a office in there because downstairs we already have uh, like we do have a um, painting easel and we do have a guitar but we do not have electronics in here I believe I don't no we don't have that in here so I wanted it to be different because normally you always make office right I wanted it to be with kids but show that you don't always need a computer and everything so i made it different i guess i don't know what i'm talking about <laughs> but i wanted to have four people in it and be fully functional show that a kids room can be pretty dark like and here we have a bit of gray but i wanted to show that a kids room can be dark and still be so so cute so i went in with all of these toys like these are black toys, those run perfectly. And just a bit of plushies. And some, um, the only thing that isn't really black is the lamp that I, the big one at least. Like we've got those two uh, hanging lamps, but that one, that's the only thing that isn't actually colored. And yeah, the bunnies, but like everything you see, I try to keep it dark or at least dark themed. 
a bit of edginess I think to it and yeah just some toys here and there <coughs> sorry guys and I didn't know what I want to do with the whole way just straight on so I didn't know what I want to do so I just decorated the tiniest bit and then we're actually almost finished we only need to go to the garden because also the garden is really really black I think I love the garden the most because um, of course there's greens and I didn't want to go full on with the flower colors so again lots of greens here and there a little bit of flowers but yeah nothing too crazy but eventually I think I put in a whole lot of flower not flowers but um, yeah additional stuff with black to it so I could show you can have a perfect garden which isn't colorful not flowery colorful just I wanted to make a statement that the house can be beautiful without too much colors so here you have the end result let me know in the comments down below what you think of a fully black house and please check out every lovely youtuber that I mentioned below because they're awesome and I hope you guys enjoyed it see you this evening with the next video bye guys love you